Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your monthly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Okay, um, let's get into this Taurus. Thank you Lord God for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. Alright, so Taurus, let's see what the energy is for you this month. Let's see. What's the energy for Taurus this month? All right. Ooh, the five of pentacles. So you could be feeling left out. You could be feeling lack. You could be feeling neglected. Neglected. Ignored. You know, maybe like a castaway. Um... You could be feeling like someone's trying to swindle you or use you, okay? This card talks about um, people who are strong in their self-worth cannot be used because they understand their worth. They understand that people always want something from them because they are valuable. They're worthy. Therefore, they can't be used. Okay, so shift your dynamic, your perspective on... Um, People wanting something from you. Do create boundaries, parameters um, for people, you know, asking of you. But do understand that you're valuable. You, um, you're worthy. So people will ask of you. Um, what is the saying? Too much is given, much is required, or something of that nature. With the five of pentacles here. Um, also, it says that maybe in a love relationship, yeah, there's neglect, there's somebody just ignoring the other person. Someone has lack of confidence in forward movement. So this is the energy of the month. Do know that with the fives, it's temporary energy, okay? So it, it can be shifted. It can be changed. Um, the five of pentacles talks about um, the Greek goddess uh, Pinia. I might be pronouncing it incorrect, but she um, goes around the village knocking on doors, knocking on the doors of the homes of the villagers. And uh, whoever lets her in, uh, they have a hard time getting her out. You know, she's the Greek goddess of poverty. So um, with that story, um, it, it talks about if pover poverty does set in, if destitution, if you being at a place of lack, if it does set in with you, um, change and shift your mindset, the dynamic as quickly as possible because if you don't, you're going to have a hard time getting out of that energy, okay? Um, like the story said, if you let her in your home, you're going to have a hard time getting her out. So um, don't let this be you know your story you know what was me this will always be me i'm just poor no 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 you have the opportunity to shift this energy especially the five of pentacles um because it's such an earthly energy you need more you do more you need more and you do nothing you get nothing so that's what we have for that Let's see um, what you need to release. What does Taurus need to release? What does Taurus need to release this month? Uh, the Knight of Wands. So maybe some kind of fly by night, in and out energy. Somebody who doesn't let the grass grow under their feet. Someone who's handsome, attractive. Could be a woman also. Um, it could be a person or it, it just could be some conquest. Um, maybe you need to release all of these, um, this, you know, all these creative opportunities that present themselves to you, but they go nowhere fast or you either leave as quickly as you, as you go, as you come, you leave as quickly as you um, come. You, um, you need to release, uh, Maybe being so passionate and on fire about something or someone, um, but not having any real plan of action. You know what you want from them, but outside of getting what you want or desire, you don't know what's next. 
Um, so you may you might need to release such a temporary energy. Um, you might want to um, kind of interchange that with something who, or with somebody who, or with something that is that provides you with longevity. Okay, um, if that's what you're looking for, you need to release one night stands. You need to release just being overly passionate. Um, about uh, maybe different sexual conquest, um, partying, um, being a showboat, showmanship here. Um, you need to release the adventure um, of, you know, conquering something or someone. You need to release that energy. I don't know why you need to release it, but it says something that you need to release. Um, Something to reevaluate, maybe because it's taking you to a place of feeling, you know, lack with the Five of Pentacles, because the Five of Pentacles is the energy of the month, or you just feeling less than, or just no no confidence in anything or anyone, because maybe you, you're going too fast, too quickly about it. I don't know. Or this is the energy of someone else around you. Something to reevaluate for this month, Taurus. Let's see what you need to reevaluate this month. What do you need to reevaluate? What does Taurus okay? Uh, the Three of Wands. So you need to reevaluate what you're waiting for, or what, or who you're waiting for. You need to reevaluate um, expanding with a certain group. Um, you need to evaluate social circles. Maybe even going to certain events. You need to evaluate who you communicate with. Maybe um, you need to evaluate gossip. You know, um, is it far reaching? Um, are you manifesting uh, bad things or bad energy? You need to reevaluate. Um, maybe taking something, you know, on a larger scale here. You might need to scale something back, or you might have to wait just a while longer for something with the three of wands here. Um, you might need to reevaluate travel or travel to or someone coming to you. Um, yeah, this is what you need to reevaluate. Uh, you might need, so let's see what else I can get from the three of wands. <clears throat> you need to reevaluate where you put your work in or where you put work in or what you put work into is it going to provide you a return because you're definitely waiting um are you is it going to be a successful completion of this project um you put a lot of heart and soul into it you put a lot of energy force behind it um yeah you, you might need to reevaluate that Let's see what you have neglected or you will neglect this month. The Justice card. So um, maybe you have neglected some paperwork, some form formalities, some uh, decision that is out of your hands. Um, maybe even a divorce. You have neglected um, a person who um, is not uh, in your energy or they're not, you're not seeing them on a day-to-day -day basis, um, but they're still in your energy. You have neglected maybe a friend group or a friend, or um, you've neglected to apologize to someone, or vice versa, them to apologize to you. Um, you have neglected to repay debts or debt consolidation or something of that nature. Paperwork coming up. Um, you've neglected to find balance here in spirituality and then practicality. You have just maybe leaned more to one of those, being overly practical or just like overly spiritual. You haven't found balance between the two. You have neglected, um, or you will neglect, um, what else am I getting from this? Yeah, some decision being rendered here. I don't think it's one that you you make. You're waiting for it. Um, or you have just completely put it out of your mind. 
you could put some people out of your mind. Um, you've neglected neglected um, handling business matters. Interesting. Okay, something to look forward to this month. What does Taurus have to look forward to? Okay, very nice. The High Priestess. The High Priestess showing up. She says, solve the riddle in your life right now. Something is a riddle. Something is coming up as a riddle. Um, something to look forward to with the High Priestess. For some of you, um, just... You know, on the lower scale of this, look look forward to some really good sex, some passionate nights, um, some fulfilling sex, some mind blowing sex, if you will. Um, look forward to a connection, a union, a partnership, maybe with someone that you hadn't been looking at, or you haven't been given the time or the attention to, someone who has been kind of. They have kind of extract, maybe can like, they've kind of left the relationship here. Um, maybe because they are the, are the woman, okay? Um, look forward to seeing this person, to traveling towards this person. You're planning to do something with this person. Um, look forward to uh, making some decision in terms of this person, this energy. Look forward to some repressed talents, maybe resurfacing. You get in with mentorship so that they can, you can foster and better cultivate your talent. Um, look forward to um, your work ethic being strengthened. You're doing something every single day. Um, yeah, look forward to money. Money matters. Okay. Let's see what will help you this month, Taurus. What will help Taurus? Very nice. The Six of Wands. It actually talks about help in business. Six of Wands. Um, look forward to balance. Um, harmony. Look forward to strutting your stuff. Um, getting it done. Being promoted. Being successful looking good while doing it winning the battle if there was a battle here especially in, in court we got justice in the high priestess here um look forward to um pride comes before the fall if you are cheating or there's some cheating scandal i don't know if you're going to kind of um you you kind of skirt around that. You don't get caught. Um, look forward to that. Or if you are the, if you're cheating with someone, look forward to maybe getting out of this connection and um, you not being all caught up in a scandal. The Six of Wands can sometimes talk about scandal also. Um, yeah, look forward to just helping business Helping your home, winning the battle, looking good while doing it, strutting your stuff, pr promotion, accolades, awards or rewards, people singing your praises, um, things uh, just being in harmony and balance here. Very nice, especially if you're a business owner. So this is what I have for you. Taurus, if it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your reading there. Take advantage of the new moon manifestation ritual. If you want to bring new energy into your life, new love, new money, new friends, new emotions, get in on the ritual where we manifest corporately, okay? The link is below. Also, donate to the channel if you feel the mood to do so by clicking the Buy Me a Coffee link. Subscribe, like, comment. Um, also, you can ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Thank you, Taurus. Many blessings to you. Take care.